Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'll be telling you how to get Haki in Blocks Fruits. Haki is also known as Enhancement. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It's free to do so and really helps me out. Let's get straight into the video. Right, so if you want Haki, then you're going to have to go to First C, which is accessible to everybody. Yay! If you don't know what Haki is, it takes your regular melee or sword or gun or something and makes it do more damage, makes you be able to hit low gear users and also gives you extra defense. So that's really awesome. It's really easy and cheap to get. All you need is 25,000 cash. As you can see, I've got 333,000 right here. And then you want to head over to the snow island. I'm at the main town right now, so you're going to see the jungle right there, and then you head to the right and that big rock over there. Now that you're at the snow, the frozen village, you are going to want to come around the side into this cave. Walk through. If you want, there's a chest up here. Free a thousand belly, and then you come to the ability teacher. Click to interact. And you can buy the enhancement, which is Haki. Now it's 25,000. On your keyboard, the hotkey is J to use it. I already have it, as you can see there. That's why I'm using it here. And it is really awesome. You can also buy the sky jumps, which is basically just this. You got 10 of them. And you can also buy the flash step for 100,000, which is the teleport. But back onto the Haki. Haki has six different stages. The first stage is stage zero. That's where you have half of your legs or half of your arms, depending on what fighting style you use. And that gives you a multiplier of 1.1 to your damage for non-fruit attacks. This is basically an extra 10% damage. As you can see, Without Haki, I do 1,252. With Haki, I do 1,467, which is way more. Stage 1 is the full arms or full legs, which goes up all the way to here or your entire arms. You get this by having 4,000 XP in your Haki. Now you may be asking, oh, how do I get XP for my Haki? Every time you hit an NPC with either your melee, your sword, or your gun, it doesn't matter if it's a click or a move, they both give one Haki XP. So, for example, if I use my flying kick, I would get one Haki XP, and if I use my breakdance, I'd get as many Haki XP as I get as the amount of times I hit the thing. So something like Dark Step or electric C move or dragon talon Z move are really good because they hit very fast in a small amount of time. So there I would have gotten a lot of XP and that I would have gotten a lot of XP from as well. You need 4000 to get full arms or full legs. It has the same buff as stage 1. Stage 2 is either full legs and torso or full arms and torso. Now this gives an additional 9% defense. So for example, if I were to get uh, usually 100 damage done to me, and I t had my Haki on, it would instead do 91 damage, which helps for your survivability. You need 12,000 XP for that. Stage 3 is full arms, torso and head, or full legs, torso and head. This gives an extra 9% off from the previous stages. So, if I were to get 100 damage done to me, in s and I had my Haki on, instead of 100 damage, I would take 83 damage. You need 24,000 XP for that. Stage 4 is full arms, torso, head, and half legs, or full legs, torso, head, and half arms. That's the previous stage's damage and 
defense with an extra 8% off, which is roughly a 24% defense buff. You need 48,000 XP for that. And finally, stage 5 is full body, which is the previous stages with an extra 7% off that, which is a 30% defense buff, which is awesome. Here he's doing 134, and now he's only doing 95. That's because I've got stage 5, the final stage. It does not look like I have the full body Haki, but I do have it unlocked. The reason it doesn't look like I have it is because I talked to the enhancement editor. The enhancement editor only changes the visuals of your Haki. You still keep whatever level Haki you are up to. In first C, it would have been in this house, but it's currently unavailable to talk to. In the second C, it's located at, located at the set home point NPC near the big castle where Don Swan spawns. For the third C, it's located in the castle on the sea on one of the tall ledges. You can only change to whatever Haki level you have already unlocked while keeping the maximum Haki stages buff that you have. If you want to get a color, you need to go in the second or third C and talk to the enhancement color dealer. You can buy the colors for fragments. That's all you need to know for enhancement or Haki. If you enjoyed or found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.